Hi folks, this is Max from uh, GalaxyS3Root.com. So I've got a quick ROM overview of Chaos ROM for your international Galaxy S3 GTI 9300. Um, you're in luck because I really like this ROM. It comes with four different launchers. Um, you can turn your phone into a Sony Xperia, uh, turn it into an HTC phone, or you can even uh, run the regular TouchWiz, or you can even run the Nova Launcher to run it in AOSP. Uh, all of these cool features in one ROM, which is really nice. For Xperia, you get Walkman album movies, um, some of the Sony apps, uh, so you can turn it into a Xperia Z. Now, you do have an option to just install those, not the extras, if you don't want it, if you just want the Xperia Z, or if you just want the Sense, um, you do have that option. And uh, I'll show you the ROM install in a bit. Uh, but the coolest part about this ROM is that not only it comes with four different launchers, um, you do have a multi-window enable for all apps along with those launchers, which is really nice uh, for multitasking on the go. And also, if you want to add, uh, let me just set this to Sense4 launcher. Uh, if you want to add more apps to your multi-window, it does come with multi-window control. Simply add your apps that you want to multitask here, um, you know, other than the ones supported regularly. Um, so I added Dolphin there. That's how you do it. Uh, battery life should be pretty good on this ROM. Um, you do have also option of uh, running different kernels. Um, the one I'm running actually draining a little bit quick, quicker than I, I like. Uh, don't worry about it. S tweaks sometimes does that. Uh, let's see. Uh, S tweaks there, and uh, you can overclock it to 1.8 gigahertz. I haven't uh, successfully run uh, Quadrant on that, so I do recommend you know 1.6, 1.704 at most. I did get about near 6,000 on Quadrant. Uh, you can see I've got 5,700. So performance is pretty good. And also you do have different themes you can choose, which I'll also show you in the Roma installer. Uh, um, I have the Sense theme installed here, but if you want to go totally like Sense or Xperia Z, you can choose those themes. I uh, just loaded all of them just to show you some of the different options. Um, and also you do get two different cameras, which is really nice. Um, you get the regular Android 4.2 camera or the special uh, Photosphere camera. Photosphere works, yes. You can try it, um, knock yourself out, and also uh, the regular Note 2 camera, you do have the option um, to get the slow-mo, fast mode. Uh, let's see here. Oops. Go here. And uh, you do have the option of getting the Note 2 camera, which comes with slow motion and fast motion. So very nice ROM. Um, check it out for your Galaxy S3. Please do not flash on any other Galaxy S3 other than uh, GTI 9300 and uh, very nice ROM. Check it out for this week's ROM of the week. Also pop-up browser if you want it. Uh, resizable and expose app settings. Um, you know, if you want to change the uh, app per DPI basis, I have a full instruction on that. Um, so let me show you the Roma installer now and also the restart buttons here. And let's go to recovery. Uh, there's so more, so much more options with Chaos ROM, but um, one thing I like is that it is very stable. Um, some of these ROMs with all of these features, they end up like you know too many, too many things, and it can break. Uh, but this one is very solid. And when you install it, download the zip file and install it. I've got some garbled file name there because I downloaded it off the Google Docs, but um, you should get the actual file name when you install it. Um, and also you do have option of 240 DPI or 320 DPI. The one I showed you is 320 DPI, uh, which is the regular normal, which is I recommend. But if you want to make the screen a little bit bigger, you can go to 240 DPI, which is sort of like makes it into a uh, tablet mode. And anytime you want to change, you can just reinstall uh, with different options without doing a wipe data uh, reset. So for 240 DPI, that's what I recommend. Um, for kernel, I recommend Perseus or Sia, and framework Samsung, um, and also lock screen. You can choose your lock screen there, and also your calendar. You do have an option of Xperia Z, Google, uh, or uh, more, and also all the Samsung apps here. And this is the Note 2 camera you want if you want Paper Artist S Note. Make sure to check that on, and also if you want inverted Google apps, you can check it there, and. Uh, um, Themes here, if you're going to go all out with Xperia, just choose everything Xperia, even the themes, uh, or Sense, if you're going to go Sense, 
Um, so that's, you know, you can only choose one, so just choose wisely. And also boot animation, and also I do recommend 23 toggles with center clock or right clock. Um, that's also customizable. And also navigation bar, if you're using 320, disable, 240, um, choose the bottom one there. And also you can make uh, your pop-up browser transparent and uh, install now. And after installing, you should boot and you should be all good to go. I'm not going to actually install it um, because I've installed it already, but uh, it should be fine. And uh, yeah, try it out for this week's uh, ROM of the week on the GTI 9300. And do let me know. I really love this ROM though. Uh, very solid. And if you have problems with battery life, you can try reinstalling with a different kernel. It has different options. Um, try it out and let me know. And uh, as always, if you have a Galaxy S3, uh, don't forget to sign up for my email list at uh, galaxys3root.com. We update you once a week with Ramon Week tips, hacks, and more. And also, if you're on YouTube, please hit that like button for me here. Subscribe button down there. And I'll see you guys soon. Uh, stay high on Android. Uh.